Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well, and in this video, I'll be talking about my story, Tales of the Southland, Chapter 7, The First Great Samaran Empire. I hope you enjoy, or at least find this video informative. With the saving of Gamara and the enslavement of the southern savages by the legions of Samara, the Gamaran region was surrounded with the Samaran heartland to the north and west, as well as the southern Samaran governorships in what would become Dwarven Stonland and the land of the elves, the land of Nature. So, a collective decision was made by the leaders and pioneer clans of Gomara to join Samara, making the Gomaran region part of the Samaran Empire, with Origin, the main city of Gomara, as its regional capital. This request was joyfully accepted by the Samarans, and when the clan leaders arrived in Sema, the capital of Samara, to finalize the joining, the twelve princes and even the emperor himself welcomed the Gomarans as equals and issued decrees of equality within the empire for both Samarans and Gomarans alike as humanity had finally come together again to rule the Southland as one superior race that did rule over the inferior savages in the elves, the dwarves, and the beasts. And so the first great Samaran Empire came to be. The age of unrivaled domination began, with no force able to challenge, let alone compete with this force, bringing peace and prosperity to all of humanity. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching Chapter 7 of Tales of the Southland. I hope you enjoyed this video, and for more Tales of the Southland, check out the playlist on your left. And if you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel down below or on your right. And until next time, ladies and gentlemen, bye for now.